on the south side of Highway 2 at the community of Index. It is impossible to miss the imposing Index Peak. And there have been a number of rescues over the years in just this one area. At the top of the waterfalls, Bridalvale Falls, is a gorgeous alpine lake called Lake Serene. And between that lake and the trailheads below, a number of accidents have occurred requiring search and rescue. One search that occurred in this area occurred to a young man who was by himself and was going to take an alternative to the trail up to the lake. And this man found himself in terrain that was too difficult to continue, either up or down, and he used his cell phone to call for assistance. A helicopter from search and rescue from the county sheriff's department flew out there with specially trained rescuers on board who had climbing skills and were able to offload one of the rescuers not too far from where this man was. Uh, The rescuer was unable to safely get to our subject and a pack was lowered from the helicopter to the man and he was given instructions to not move and to actually tie himself into the tree on the steep slope that he was in. As it got dark, there were several search teams. I was in the first one with another mountain rescuer, and we hiked up the trail to a point where we could observe a light on a cliff, which we knew to be this man. We continued on up to the lake, Probably arriving about 2 or 3 in the morning, we decided it was smart to catch a couple hours of of sleep. At dawn, the two of us started going across the slope towards uh, this person. It was very difficult to go through the thick brush. And I remember at one point slipping down about a 15-foot cliff just through this avalanche alder, as we would call it. Very hard stuff to walk through. Very low to the ground, very brushy. Frequently, your feet don't even touch the ground as you walk across. As the morning progressed, the helicopter was able to come up again and spotted the subject. They were not able to land there, and they decided they would go and rig up to do a short haul in which a rescuer would be brought in dangling from the end of the rope. And as they were doing that, the other mountain climber and myself reached the young man, and he had done fine. He had followed the instructions and was still perched on the side of this cliff. And when the helicopter came back, they lowered, or this rescuer dangling from the rope was lowered down to where we were. We put the man into a harness, and the two of them were lifted up by the helicopter and flown across the valley to where they could be safely set down.